Um, I've been diving in Jervis Bay for 20 years now and fell in love with it the moment I first put my face underwater. I'm actually coming up to my 3,000th dive very soon. Eight more dives to go. <laughs> Every time I go diving, I record all the animals and marine life that I see, mainly for my own benefit, for my dive vlog, but uh, also happy to share that information with researchers and other people that might be interested. Because I've gotten to learn all the marine life here, or I'd like to think so anyway, I'm aware of what's different when we see something different. I can spot that easily. We have such a variety of diving here, from very deep dives, sites that can only be accessed by boat, and then to our very easy shore dives. I particularly love doing the shore dives because we get to stay underwater for quite a long time. We're not limited by any no decompression limits and uh, there is just a lot of marine life to see and it's a great way to uh, discover the marine life here of Jervis Bay. We've got a couple of sites. Uh, one of them in particular, my favourite, is Murray's Beach. Murray's Reef there it has lots of schools of fish, um, a whole variety of marine life. And then you go to another completely different site like Kararong and this is a completely different bottom habitat. We get soft corals over here, lots of nudibranchs. So this, the sites just all depend on the weather on the day and each site has its own particular marine life. So we have something here for, to please everybody for diving and that's why I'm still here 20 years later.